Do you have a minute? Nishiyama? He usually hangs out with Ida. Oh, so you want to ask him about Ida. So that's why Takamaki-san was chasing him. I'm sorry, I don't know where he is right now. He usually stays till late, so I think he's probably still somewhere in the school. I'll keep digging around while you're looking for him. Well, I guess we can let him handle this. We'll have to ask him. Serenity Blooms, thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. I hope you are doing well today. Nishiyama, that's me. You're that transfer student, right? You need something? Job? Uh, are you talking about that one time? I, I, I don't know. I said I didn't want to do it. That's something Ida. Wait, are you doing something, Am? He's been acting really strange lately. What do you mean? Is he really wrapped up in something shady? No, tell me what you know. One day, the two of us went to Shibuya, and a man approached us over near Central Street. He asked if we were interested in an easy part-time job. I said I wasn't, but Ida was into it. He was asking the guy all sorts of questions. What's the job? I, I don't know. I was so scared, I ended up going home alone. But according to Ida, it only takes 10 minutes, and is good for people who don't stand out. Ida started spending a lot of money. That's when his strange behavior began, too. But that's all I know. That's enough, right? A man on Central Street, huh? That is suspicious. Maybe he was making him commit crimes? Have you found out anything, Kira? I've tried looking into the high-paying part-time job myself. We were talking about it here as well. Supposedly the man will talk to you in broad daylight over on Central Street. Uh, and your job will be to deliver a small envelope he hands you. Well, I'll contact you again if I hear anything more. So that means this part-time job is somehow crime-related. Yep. It takes ten minutes, is good for people who don't stand out, and involves a small envelope. Does that ring any bells? It's something the Mafia would definitely be up to. Drugs. Like illegal drugs? Maybe they made Ida smuggle drugs for them. That definitely fits with a small envelope. And you can get arrested just for possession. Did you meet Isadama? You know, on my own anyways. Rumor has that you got involved with some kind of suspicious part-time job. The job apparently is totally insane. Something about trafficking drugs! There we go, I didn't even remember. You hear that they ask you to take part in it down at Central Street in broad daylight, even. There we go. Smuggling. Yep. This won't be pretty. Come on, let's go back to Lady On. We'll ask Ida directly. Excuse me? Uh, back down the stairs. Wait, we're class 2D, right? This is our class? Yes. Please tell me about the job, or else my beloved Francois. She's still doing that? Alright, take a. Uh, come on, you two? I already told you I don't know. He did? That bastard! Damn it! <laughs> Shit. Well, if you already know about it, fine. I don't want to talk about it here. Let's go somewhere a little quieter. What's up with you? Especially in front of everyone. Yeah, I got a job. So what? Isn't that normal? What are you getting at? 
You're a drug smuggler. How did you? I've only told one person about that. Of all people, I can't believe you were the one to find out. You're right. They told me they had an easy part-time job for me, and I ended up smuggling drugs. All I had to do was put envelopes into coin lockers, and they said they'd give me a hefty paycheck. I didn't know what was in the envelopes, though. Still, this is what came out of it. Are you being threatened? So you knew, huh? They started threatening me right after they deposited the money into my bank account. They had pictures of me carrying the goods. Said they'd expose what I did unless I paid them off. You know? Why are you even asking me this stuff? Are you just gonna use my job to blackmail me too? Never. I see. Well, even if you were planning on doing that, I don't have any money I could give you. If you're really interested in that job, try heading over to Central Street. That's where they told me about it. I, I told you everything you want to know, right? Can I go? Well then. He didn't even wait for us to respond. How'd it go? Did Don's acting help at all? I think probably not. It went perfectly, I think. More importantly, we were able to find anything, Akira. And it's drugs. So they ask you to deliver drugs. That's serious. Just searching the Shibuya drugs, there's a ton of hits too. So they're making people traffic drugs, then threatening them. That must be what I heard people talking about in Shibuya. They seem to be going about this quite openly during the daytime. What a bold mythology. I would have imagined that they would do it at night. I wonder why they chose the daytime. They go for high schoolers. I see. Yes, more students will be out during the day, while the police will be cautious at night. Yuji, you're over in Shibuya now, right? Do you see anyone like this there? I am at Central Street. It's tough telling, though. I mean, there are just way too many people. The rain's not helping either. Uh, let's do this tomorrow. Yeah, it seems like the early choice now. Split up and search separately then. In any case, we have some new intel. Call the progress for today. Whoever asks us to take the job should know who their boss is too. All right, I'll get in touch with you guys later tonight. See what. Make a plan. Alrighty. Stretch. Oh. Oh. <sighs> I thought I actually had a customer, but no, it's just you. Give me customers when it rains. The re cash register is gonna run dry at this rate. I'm going to find them tomorrow for sure. It's the only lead we have right now. Yeah, it's highly likely those part time solicitors somehow related to the mafia. If we tail him and lead us straight back to his boss. He talked to Ida and Yishima... Ishiyama at Central Street, right? Indeed, it seems that those were the target weights, and we should do... should be the one to go. Leave it up to me. Yeah, that's probably the best idea. I didn't stand out too much. I'll take that as a compliment. I have no objections, but we'll leave it to you, Kira. Tricking people and using as blackmail, those bastards are true cowards. It's kind of scary to think that people like that are all around us in the city. Well, guys, we gotta brace ourselves. We're up against serious criminal here. Hi, buddy. Where'd you go? Let's see if we have any city armor. Okay. Oh, we do good.
I saw Nijima arguing with the principal about the mafia stuff or something. What was that all about? I hear her older sister's involved with the investigation. Maybe she's just trying to play detective too. Are you kidding me? I can't handle student council president with no focus. What? <laughs> why do you- why, like, why are you worried about the student council president? Like, seriously. Okay, we're all here. There sure are a lot of high schoolers during the day. They must be targeting them somehow. Finding the specifics may be difficult. With such a crowd, the odds are against us. Right, we're gonna grab them by the tail. You should head over to Central Street, like we planned yesterday. Sweet, let's get going. Let me know if you find any shady people. Alright, let's go. Just as we planned. We might end up running into the Mafia. Be ready for anything. Hello. Are you investigating here with your friends today? Hope something comes and we're counting on you. Aren't you interested in all the hottest brand names? We're having a special sale just over there. How about you go take a peek? We ordered way too much, so I have a ton left over. My boss will kill me if I go back to him with all these extras. Look, I'll sell them to you for cheap. What do you say? What should we do? It depends on the price, wouldn't you say? Hey, what about you? These are unforgettable deals. I'm not interested. Well, that's disappointing. Come back if you change your mind. Come on, the shop's right around here. How about you come take a look? Seems like some kind of sale. You probably shouldn't bother. Hmm? Some kind of password. I have no idea what you're talking about. Introduce me. I see. So I need to go... Miss <laughs> President's here. Walk past her in the station. She's keeping an eye on us? Maybe I guess she's curious about all of this. Oh wait, more importantly, how do you get things going you're in? Nothing so far. Everyone's we can't fall. Mishima. Alright, Mishima. Makoto. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. I think we talked to him once, right? Hmm? Where was he? Say it, I mean, say it. Talking about the ordinary job, huh? Take my vest, don't do it. How do I meet them?
How's it going? Found anything? Maybe a little. Grass, something around. Something like Yukira. Gathering so far. I'll start. Supposedly, some guy near the excess wa uh, exa way taking some kind of strange drugs. Strong drugs. I'm not counting on anything, but I'll check it out. Apparently, they're at mostly targeting girls. I'll go do it. see about that. My end, I heard there are people talking about strange things in the back alley near the arcade. Something about ice and vegetables. Uh. All right, we should do. I have no idea which of these leads are real. Try going to the most suspicious-sounding place. Something wondering where the arcade is. I'm going now. Aren't you? Won't be looking for any trouble. progress toward finding the boss. Well, you aren't wrong about that. Hey, you two got some time? I have a great job for you. It's real easy. Guess you could call it a delivery job. It seems we didn't have to look very hard in the end. You're high schoolers, yeah? Don't you want something more than just your allowances? Hmm. By delivery, do you mean that of suspicious materials? Huh. <laughs> You're a funny girl. So, you won't answer me. Then I was right. Huh? What's up with you anyways? Why are you asking all these questions, huh? Oh. Uh... It was all a joke. 
Why would I get worked up over some dumb kids? Anyways, I can't hang. See ya. Um, if you don't want to deal with us, we could always go see your boss ourselves. You really gonna say that, knowing who he is? <laughs> no way I believe that. Well, I'm out of here. You guys are annoying me. I'm pretty sure he's part of the mafia we're looking for. Let's go after him. I think we should get some proof before we do that. I tried to trick him into saying something, but he dodged all the traps I was laying down. By the way, thanks for standing up for me. I I'm going to go now. That boss seems tricky. And it looks like he taught his subordinates well, too. No wonder the police are having trouble catching him. Anyway, you have some serious guts. You didn't back down at all against that hooligan. Though we still didn't end up with any new information. Let's stop here for today. Wanna meet up? Let's do it. It's safe though. Ask tons of people about the chance they'll be following. Just to be safe, we should refrain from doing anything that makes ourselves stand out. Sun's going to set. Let's disband for today and report the fighting tomorrow. Uh, meet at karaoke tomorrow. Talk in private and be cheap after school. They call themselves the Hustle Hour. Dude, it's the Muscle Hour. Wait, is that the wrong two? Um, hello, happy hour? Muscle hours just sound sweaty. Anyways, see you guys karaoke tomorrow. It's an unknown number. Hello, this is Nijima. Makoto, Nijima. Thanks for earlier. How'd you get my number? I dug it up. I realize I'm apologizing after the fact, but it just didn't feel right keeping it from you, so that's all. Bye. I'm searching all along. You talking to a woman? I heard her voice. Speaking of, some girl called looking for you around noon. Said she's the class president. Said she's got something that belongs to you. She seemed to know you, so I gave her your number. She must have looked up LeBlanc's address trying to contact you. That Nijima sure is thorough. Then again, she called you just to apologize. It's a bit weird, but maybe she's not so bad after all. Yep, I would definitely agree with that. Hey. <sighs> Mm. Alrighty, um, I know it's a little early, but I think this is a good stopping point, because I don't know how much we're gonna, like, how deep we're gonna get into other stuff. So, I'm gonna go ahead and call it here for this. today. Okay, and we finished saving. That way, we're good for the next time. Which we'll probably play this next week, honestly. Um, but yeah. Alright, you guys, let's go to the ending screen and see if there's someone we can read today, okay? Alright.